Noch was über Voodoo heute? Tell me more about current Voodoo. You have tapped my resources. My expertise is really historical. Perhaps Ms. Moonbeam can be of further help. Okay. What exactly is Hoodoo? Hoodoo refers to magic folk traditions of the South. Hoodoo is a bastard of Hoodoo. Many of the Grigri are similar, but Hoodoo does not have the religious aspects of Voodoo. Wie gesagt, das ist wahrscheinlich das, was wir unter Voodoo verstehen. Is there anything else I should know about Voodoo? Not if your interest is primarily in Voodoo. Okay, that's it. Voodoo is of interest to those who study rural folk traditions, but it will not aid you in understanding true Voodoo. Tell me more about Marie Laveau. There were actually two Marie Laveaux, mother and daughter. Most people thought they were the same woman. Her continued youth added to the mystique. The original, the mother, was also known as Widow Paris. It was she that began the empire. When the Widow Paris began to practice, there were many Voodooans in the city. By 1830, she was Voodoo Queen of all New Orleans. Hmm? Tell me more about Marie Laveau. The Widow Paris was a hairdresser for rich Creole ladies. She also paid household servants to spy for her. Between the two, she knew everything about everyone who mattered in New Orleans. She was not above using her information to appear psychic, to intimidate, or even to blackmail. You sound as though you admire her. For a black woman in the mid-1800s to gain power is an incredible thing, Mr. Knight. However, she achieved it. That's stimmt. Tell me more about Marie Laveau. She kept a pet snake, danced with it. She held traditional voodoo ceremonies out by the uh -huh. She took herself seriously. Very seriously. But she was not above selling tickets for her events to curiosity seekers. She was not above using voodoo any way she could to make money. That is for certain. Das muss man ja bewundern, ne? If she had been in another line of work, genau. in another age, das that would have been interpreted as entrepreneurial genius rather than a sign of fraudulence. Hey, you don't need to convince me. I admire anyone that can actually make a living. <laughs> Tell me more about Marie Laveau. It was Marie Laveau who defined the voodoo that is truly and uniquely the voodoo of New Orleans. She invented hundreds, if not thousands of spells, potions, charms, and incantations. These form the basis of the modern practice, not to mention the folk tradition of voodoo. Tell me more about Marie Laveau. Her daughter, Marie Glapion, took over when the widow Paris got old. Most people thought it was the same Marie Laveau. Both Maries encouraged that point of view. The widow Paris died in 1881. Marie Glapion had been reigning a long time by then. After the death of the widow Paris, other voodoo queens surfaced, and by 1890, the cult was fragmented again. Marie Glapion just sort of faded away. Hmm. Tell me more about Marie Laveau. The Laveau tomb, where one or both of the Maries are believed to be buried, is in St. Louis Cemetery No. 1. It is a popular shrine for practitioners and tourists alike. I myself take tours through the cemetery on a regular basis. Really? Do you have any running this way? No. But the cemetery is open to the general public as well. Das macht ja nichts, ich war ja schon da. Gut, ich glaube, das war erschöpfend, erst wenn wir mit ihm geredet haben. Ich merke auch schon die Schnauze voll. 
Okay, ein paar neue Dinge erfahren. Ach, die Schlange, sag mal. Passt das vielleicht dazu? Ist weit entfernt, Doktor. Vielleicht sollte Gebel mehr über diese Schuppe und Erfahrung bringen, bevor sie jemanden zeigt. Hm, okay. Lass uns mal diese, diese Magentia Mondbeam versuchen. Goodbye, Mr. Knight. Vielleicht kann die mir über das spirituelle Voodoo erzählen. Das würde ich mir interessieren. Da ist es jetzt. Welcome, Seeker. You must be the one Dr. John called me about. I guess so. My name is... Wait? Gabriel Knight? <laughs> You're too quick for me. Ach, es ist so stimmungsvoll, das Spiel. Actually, Dr. Schön. John told me. You have come to the right place, Mr. Knight. Tell me how I can help. Ach, schau mal, da ist eine Schlange da drin. Eine große Schlange ruht sich am Boden eines altmodischen Vogelkäfigs aus. Magentia ist offensichtlich nicht die geborene Hausfrau. Eine alte Schlangenhaut teilt sich den Käfig mit ihrer früheren Besitzerin. Hm, das müssen wir uns mal später anschauen. Could I ask you a few questions? Of course, Seeker. What can you tell me about Voodoo? My practice is mainly selling charms and potions with magic power, such as Grigri and Voodoo Oils. You know, everything from unrequited love to wandering spouses to winning a lawsuit. But my spells and charms are powerful, and they work. Echt? What do you know? About the voodoo murders. Why, that has nothing to do with me and my clientele. But I can tell you that you should stay as far from it as possible. There is badness there. Very bad. This makes me a bit concerned. What can you tell me about New Orleans? New Orleans is the center of voodoo practice in the United States. Do you know anything about snakes? Snakes? You mean like my beloved Grimwald? She's a python, you know. Quite deadly in the wrong hand. I was trained by one of the great voodoo queens to learn how to hypnotize and handle snakes. Huh. Tell me more about snakes. Oh, I wouldn't want to give away my trade yes. secrets. What's the significance of St. John? St. John's Eve, it is the greatest night of the voodoo year. There is always a traditional conclave on St. John's Eve. Most of our voodoo churches these days hold functions in the church hall. But in the old days, they had ceremonies out in the wild, and they wore animal masks and had a huge bonfire and dance. I used to go when I was an apprentice. Sometimes in the swamp, you know, Bayou St. John. Wieder Bayou St. John. Und wieder Ufer und Ponchatrainsee. Hm. Do you have any idea what Caprice Saint Gaon means? Uh, no. No, I don't. Hm, das wirkt sehr, sehr komisch. Do you know anything about Marie Laveau? Oh, yes. She was the first of the great voodoo queens. Gut. Mehr möchte ich da jetzt drüber wissen, wir haben ja schon genug erfahren. Tiermasken, das ist interessant. Tell me about the animal masks. I saw them used once or twice when I was younger, but you don't see them much anymore. They are too close. Close? Too close to what? Just bad karma. Sieht mhm. nicht gut an. Have you ever heard the word? Dumme Frage. Shot I don't know anything about that. Tell me about yourself. Yes. What would you like to hear? How'd you get into this business? I trained in the voodoo arts for many years with the great queen Tabitha. Sie wirklich gibt? Really? Who's she? You have never heard of her? For shame! Ja, tut mir leid. I can see you know little of the world of magic. I'm beginning to get that impression, yes. What kind of people come to see you? Seekers after the truth, such as yourself. 
do you do anything else? I am a voodoo yen, and that is plenty. It takes much spiritual effort. How many voodoo yens are there? No one knows exactly. Many practice in secret. There are probably hundreds. But of course the level and the power of the voodoo yens differ greatly, depending on their training and natural gifts. Mm -hmm. I can't think of anything. Very well. Uh, about Grimwald. What about her? Where'd you get Grimwald? She belonged to a traveling reptile show. She was being terribly mistreated, so I offered to buy her. She's named after a spirit guide I had once. The spirit Grimwald was a very powerful female snake priestess in Egyptian times. Grimwald doesn't sound Egyptian. I only know what the spirits tell me. Monsieur, I am sure they know better than we. Das mag sein. Ich würde auch gerne Schlange haben. How'd you learn to handle Grimwald? I told you a great voodoo queen taught me. She learned from Marie Laveau herself. Ah, oh, fascinating. Put this box on. Would you consider giving me one of Grimwald's scales? No, I couldn't do that. Mm -hmm. You might do some Grigri of your own. No. Oh. One must be very careful with such things. Hair clippings, nail parings, and snake scales. How about showing me how you handle Grimoire? Really? You would like to see me dance, perhaps? That would be... swell. I won't make you wait, Monsieur Knight. Das ist schon eine ziemlich einnehmende Stimme, muss ich sagen. Also ich meine das jetzt positiv. No matter what you see, be frightened. I'll give it my best shot. Los, tanz! Du aus dem Weg haben. Hm. Jetzt wird's endlich mal interessant. So, komm, ja? Schön, ja, sieht super aus. Ja, machst du ganz toll, Kleiner. Aber ich will bloß die Haut. Haha. <lacht> Gebel nimmt die alte Schlangenhaut, während Magenza anderweitig beschäftigt ist. Klatsch war Göbel es nicht gemacht hat. <lacht> They are truly inspiring, isn't ja, ich sehe ja schon. That's certainly one word for it. Genau. Okay. But I ask you a few more questions. Certainly. Ich bin jetzt komplett erleuchtet. Give me an example of a gri gri. All right. Here's an old one. Take a lodestone and some brimstone to a crossroads at midnight. Light the brimstone with a match, and a spirit will come and give you advice in gambling. Übrigens habe ich das schon probiert und ähm, natürlich hat's funktioniert. Ja. Gut, äh, ich glaube, wir konnten ihr noch mal zeigen, aber ich habe schon eine Menge gute Informationen von ihr bekommen. Ähm, das hier, diesen Code. Am Grab von Marie Labuschkeit. Genau. Oh, the Voodoo Code. It is very secret, yes. Super. I studied it with my mentor, the great Queen Tabitha. Really? Great. Can you tell me what it says? Hmm. Let's see. Well, some of it is nonsense, I'm afraid. Whoever wrote this wasn't very good. That's all right. Just tell me what it says. It starts with a D and a J. A then, <laughs> okay, this part makes sense. It says, Conclave tonight, bring... Um, then there's more nonsense. F-W-E-T-K-A-S-H. Well, that last bit might mean cash. cash. Fresh cash? Fat cash? It doesn't make much sense. Yeah. That's okay. Heißt das viel Geld? <lacht> DJ Conclave. K-A-S-H. It's a star. Hm. Egal. I'm happy I could help. Ja, ich danke dir auch. Vielen Dank. Das ist ja schon mal ein Anfang. Gut, wir hauen ab. Das ist eine unheimliche well, Frau. Gut. Ciao. Do what you will, if it harm no. Count on. 
Aber dann. Okay, ähm. Wo gehen wir jetzt nächstes hin? Ich würde sagen. Hier zum Wechsel im Black Store. Vor allem, wir haben jetzt gehört, dass Tiermasken wohl wichtig sein sollen. Also können wir vielleicht jetzt ihn ansprechen auf die. Was kon das konnten wir vorher noch nicht. Hallo! Mhm. Ja, kaufen. Oh, eine Frau. Oh Gott, so eine alte, vornehme Dame. Scheiß Kleffer. Bonjour, Monsieur Walker. Oh, bienvenue, Madame Kaffee. Como se va? How you be feeling today? Well, I'll tell you, Mr. Walker. I'm certain someone's buried a sleep not back somewhere near my steps. I haven't slept a week in weeks. Oh, don't that beat all. Well, you're gonna need some easy night candles then. Do you think that would help? I do hope you're right. I said three rosaries this morning for our lady's intervention. Rosaries are good, sure enough. But you burn those candles too and you're gonna whip any old no sleep gree gree, I tell you for sure. Very well, Mr. Walker. Put them on my account and send them round to my house. Oh, and there's another thing. I didn't catch her at it. But I know Mrs. Lefebvre put stomachache powder in my tea at the last meeting of the Creole Grand Dames. Oh, I've been in misery. You put nine pinheads up in a little box, add a pinch of graveyard dust, and put it under her front porch step. That'll turn the trick back on Mrs. Lefebvre, and she'll be the one with the bellyache. I have the pins, And the dust. Right here if you want them. If the Blessed Virgin will grant me her protection, I'll be safe from these practitioners of evil. We, oui, madame. Though it don't hurt to be proactive, none neither. Now does it. Naturellement, monsieur. Merci beaucoup. Mais non, madame. It is nothing. Au revoir. Das macht ein bisschen Angst, dass der Willy sich so gut auskennt mit Grigris. Äh, Grigris. 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 Die Madame Casano ist ja auch äh, interessant. Die ist eine ziemlich gläubige Frau, so wie es aussieht, aber sie scheint sehr mit Grigri und Voodoo was äh, sich auszukennen. Die müssen wir mal unbedingt verfolgen. Vielleicht weiß ja der gute Herr, wo die wohnt. Can I ask you just a few more questions? Whatever, man. Yeah, man. That customer of yours, the little old lady. Customer? The woman I saw in here, Madame Cazonu, you called her. I don't talk about my customers to men coming off the street. Bist du eine Pfeife, Willy Wonka? Kommt hier Masken. Do you know anything about animal masks? Like the ones in the voodoo rituals they do for the tourists? Right. I used to sell a few as souvenirs. The only one left is Willie Jr. over there. Huh. The old crocodile. Well, he's sort of a mascot now, him. Can we sell him? About Willie Jr., would you be willing to let him go? Hmm, maybe. For a hundred dollars. Wie wär's für nichts? A hundred bucks? You've got to be kidding. Me and Willie Jr. are very close now. I could part with him for less. Na gut, muss ich Geld auftreiben irgendwie. Äh, haben wir irgendwas noch hier? Nee. Gut, dann lass es mal zurückgehen. Kann man es auch nicht kaufen, ist ja die Maske. 100 Dollar, wo soll ich die herbekommen? Muss ich vielleicht die gute Grace verkaufen? Mal fragen, ob sie damit einwilligt. Nein, natürlich nicht. Aber ich habe wieder einen Auftrag für sie. Und zwar Nachforschung. Guten Tag. Hey Grace, hier bin ich. Oh, Joy. Ja, 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 du mich auch. So, komm her. Nachforschung, bitte. Got a minute, Grace? What's up? Und zwar... Could you do some research for me? Sure, what? Die Casano, wo wohnst du I need you to look up a Madame Casano. Madame Casano? Is she related to the murders the same way your friend Malia Getty was? Grace. Gazanu is at least 70. As if that makes a difference to oh. you. <laughs> okay, I'll see what I can find. Anything else? Nee. I 
can't think of anything. Okay. Mit diesem Diss an uns muss ich die Folge beenden, weil ich jetzt traurig bin. Und beim nächsten Mal besuchen wir dann zur Trost, zum Trost die gute Malia und schauen mal, was wir mit dir anfangen können, nicht wahr? Also haut rein, bis dann.